I still don't have any change for the call. I saw a newsstand on the other side of the square. Maybe I could get some change there. Are you okay? The war, man. It fucked me up. Really fucked me up. War can do that. Sure can. You served? No, I haven't. What the hell do you know about it? Nothing. Look, I need some change. How about a dime for a dollar? <laughs> Whatever, man. Thank you. Just leave me alone. Jesus, man. You're a mess. What do you want, man? Just leave me alone. How was it? You know, over there. What? Vietnam? Yeah. Was it as bad as they say? It's worse. War, man. Please don't get me started. I won't. fly somewhere uh, tomorrow can you make that work? well hello there handsome you're talking okay, to a married great. man just my luck what nice to see someone who's passionate about their work when what do you mean I'm not working you're not no I'm just uh, hanging out okay. all right then okay okay thanks Hey, did you get us a plane? Yeah. Yeah, I did. But I need to go. What? What are you talking about? Are you okay? I'm fine. But I need to be somewhere else right now. Hey, you can't just walk away. I'm not walking away. But something happened and I need to be there, all right? Vincent. We've come too far to back down now. You need to talk to me. Tell me what's going on in your head. Talk to me! buy us some time. We gotta get out of here. Yeah. Look up there. The vent. Come on. Yeah. I see it. Vincent, get up there and I'll push this across.
get over here. I'll help you up. Control the next one from here. Get behind it. Look, I don't know what's going on with you, but we need to finish what we started. Harvey's gonna keep sending guys like this. Yeah, I know. Do you? Then why the hell did you want to leave all of a sudden? It's my wife. She's in the hospital. What's the problem? We just had a baby. That's great news. Congrats, man. Sure, it's, it's great. Thanks. You don't seem too happy about it. Trust me, I'm happy. It's just... It's really complicated between me and my wife. Look, complicated or not, you gotta go see a kid. Whatever's going on between you two, it's still your kid. I know, you're right. Of course I am. You know I am. Yeah. Look, you got us that plane, didn't you? I did. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to the hospital, you're gonna see your kid, and then we go get that plane. You with me? Yeah. I'm with you. Vincent, I need to trust you on this one. You can trust me. All right, then. Let's go. You know, I could tell it was your first kid. You could? Yeah. Back at the hospital, the way you were holding your baby and shit. I mean, sorry about the shit part. I, I didn't mean it in a bad way, you know? But, yeah. Anyway, it's a great thing watching your kid grow up. Yeah, I can imagine it is. What's wrong, man? What's the problem with you and your wife? <sighs> Look. Carol is the love of my life. We've always wanted to have a child. We tried for years. Every time we failed. 
was like a part of us died. And when it finally happened, that day when we found out, we've never been so happy. Then, everything went to hell. And I ended up in prison. Vincent, ask the receptionist. She should know. Hey, Vincent, Excuse I me, sir. Do you know where the hospital way. is? You're in the hospital. I am? Are you okay? I get mixed up pretty easy. Doctors say I'm senile. It's just a fancy way of saying you're getting old. Can I help you, sir? Ha! That's exactly what I'd say. You have a nice day. You too. Oh, I'm sorry. I can only give that information out to relatives. Okay, sure. Vincent, get over here. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, sir. How can I help you? I need to see my wife, please. Okay. Do you know which ward she's in? She just had a baby. Oh, congrats. Uh, take the elevator right there to the top floor. Then just follow the signs. All right. seem familiar. Have I seen you before? Nah, I don't think so. Hmm. Okay. Whatever. But your faces are so familiar. I'm sure I've seen you somewhere. Problem solved. <sighs> you need help, man. What? Just don't like taking risks. That's all. So, you excited to see your baby? I'm more nervous. Understandable. I was nervous too, but don't worry. You'll be fine. Thank you. How hard can this be? Hmm. Yeah. Easier than I thought. <sighs> All right. This is fun. Yeah. I'm really good at this. Whoa! Ah! Ah, my back! Shit. All right. Maybe not. Does it really take two guys to change a light bulb? If you're in the Union, it does. And, uh, we are in the Union. Let me get this straight. The two of you both get paid for doing one man's job? Yep, we do. I kind of like how you Union guys work. Oh, yeah? You should join the Union, too. Yeah. Unfortunately, we don't have a Union for my line of work.
Excuse me, ma'am. My wife just had a baby. What's the name, please? Uh, Carol. Already. Right, just follow me, sir. Thank you. Thanks. Hey, Carol. You okay? I'm fine. Vincent, what are you doing here? She's my daughter, too. This is, uh, Leo. It's nice to meet you, ma'am. Yeah. Uh, baby girl, huh? Um, I'll leave you guys alone. I'll be waiting outside. Yeah. And, uh, congrats, by the way. Can I hold her? Okay. Perfect. Come on, you piece of shit! Work! Work! Ah, god damn it. <laughs> She's so beautiful. She is. I love you so much. I just have to finish this. You have to trust me. Carol. What do you want me to say? I just want you to trust me, okay? Things will be different. You keep saying that, but you're gonna get yourself killed. I can't live with that. I'm not gonna let that happen. I promise. You have to trust me, Carol. Shooting. We're in the hospital. Okay, let's go.
God Stay damn it. down! Don't move! Open, hey, goddammit! You under arrest! Open! Hey! Watch it! <laughs> He's over there! Stop him!
Damn. I need to find a way out of here. Check the windows. I don't know. I don't think he's that stupid. You never know with these fugitives. <sighs> I'm not so sure. Hey, you think it came through the ventilation? Yeah. Looks like it. So, where'd he go? I guess he jumped down and ran out. Yeah, he must have been fast. Coming with me. Put the gun down now. Back away. Don't hurt him. You can't win this. Shut up. Just back away. I'm warning you. Stay back. Don't do anything stupid. Shut up. Take it easy. Come closer and I'll shoot him. Put the gun down now! Back away! Don't Get over hurt him! Fuck! Piece of shit door! Open! Ugh. at large in the hospital right now. I know, I know. My colleague just called me. I think it's these two guys in the paper. Yes. Have you seen them at all? No. Are they dangerous in any way? If you see them, you make sure you stay safe. Stay away and call for any of us, okay? But will do. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. Sure. We'll be patrolling this wing for now, so we'll be close by. If you see or hear anything suspicious at all, you let us know, okay? Of course, officer. Thank you. Stay safe, ma'am. Jump out of the window. Are you shitting me? Come Just on! Give up. Open! Freeze! Fuck! Surrender! Freeze. Shit! Stop! You want to arrest? Come on! Let's go!
You sure it's a good pilot, right? Yeah, kind of sure. Come on, man. You know I'm not a fan of heights. Don't worry. Emily's a great pilot. She was practically born on the plane. Long time no see, Vincent. How you doing? Good. Hey, Leo. Nice to meet you. You too. So, you're a friend, I guess? Yeah. I hear you're a good pilot. Well, I don't know about that, but thanks. Okay. Emily, does this thing fly? What, does it look like a fucking bike? Of course it flies. Where are we going? Mexico. Mexico? You gotta be kidding me. That's way too far. I'm not flying to Mexico. Emily, you know I always pay you good. If you want to go to Mexico, you're gonna have to pay me way more than good. We'll pay you double. Just take us there. Double, huh? You good for that, Vince? Yeah, yeah. Where are you going? Where do you think? Mexico! Come on, Harvey. Come on, you, you, you gotta believe me. I, I'm, I'm telling you the truth. I would never say anything. I, I would never do that. You know that. And I, I didn't say anything. Now, they tried to get me to say something, but I didn't. Because that's not what I do. You know that. You know you've got to trust me, Harvey. I promise. Please. Please. Let him go. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Oh, God. You're doing the right thing, Harvey. You're, you're good, Harvey. What are you thinking? We need more men. He's coming. Got it. Oye, Juan. Dime, jefe. Necesitamos más hombres. Ya, dale. ¿Cuántos? Todos. Todos? Pero qué pasa? No preguntes tanto. Hazlo nomás. Oh, oh, wait. What? No! No, no! Hey. Here you go. Hey, Vincent, who is this Emily, really? Don't even ask. You ready? Yeah, I just need to fill her up. Help me out. Sure. The gas tank's right over there. Yeah. What do you think? Is this a good landing spot? Let me see. Yeah. But it's gonna be a long walk through a dense jungle. That's fine. You could also parachute down here. That would get you way closer. Uh, no thanks. I'm not good with heights. Whatever you want. Wait, Emily. Do you have parachutes here? I do. Hell no, Vincent. Are you crazy? Do you know how much time that would save us? I don't care. I haven't even seen a parachute before. It's not that hard. You just pull a cord. Right, Emily? Well, technically, you're right. Come on. What do you say? Ah, oh, shit. All right, all right. I mean, how hard can it be, right? Don't worry. You'll figure it out. On your way down. Hey, that's not even funny. Relax. I'll show you the basics before we jump. Yeah, you better. Are you being cocky now? What? No, whatever. Just show me the basics. I got this. Good. Emily, I'll handle the fuel. All right. Sorry, that's just, it's, it's, it's coming with yeah, us. Just get it on the plane, okay? Got it. Guys, 
Can you please find my logbook? Here it is. I'll just give it to Emily. Here you go. All right, guys. The plane's filled up. Unplug the fuel line. Leo, hurry up. Come on. Nervous? No. You? A little bit. Just enough to keep me focused, you know? That's good. Yeah. You know, I've been thinking about your situation with your wife. I might have a solution for you. Okay. You should write her a letter. What? Look, I don't mean to interfere, but I had a similar situation with Linda. So I decided to write her a letter, and it worked. I laid it all out, and she gave me a second chance. You know? I'm just saying that writing a letter really helped. You know? I mean, of course, it's up to you. I mean, I'm just saying that it worked for me, but it doesn't have to, you know. Anyways, look, I'm just saying, it was a good thing, that's all. You feel me? Yeah, well, I'm not really the writing type. Yeah, 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 I mean, it was just an idea. It's just... Anyway, congrats on the baby. I'm really happy for you. Thank you. Yeah. Try to 
How come you're so afraid of heights? Are you shitting me? Are you seriously gonna ask me that now? Why not? Timing's perfect. Just face your fears, Leo. You're crazy. So you're gonna tell me or should I just let you go? That's not funny, okay? <laughs> I think it is. So? What? Are you gonna tell me or not? Okay, okay, I fell down when I was young, happy? I wanna know more. Fell down from what? Come on, man! Fell down from what? I fell down from a fucking tree and broke my arm. Stop asking questions. <laughs> that's it? You broke your arm? What do you mean, that's it? I was eight years old. Did you cry? Okay, I've had enough. I'm letting go if you keep asking those stupid questions. <laughs> Be my guest. Just keep in mind that you'll break a lot more than an arm. I hate you, man. No, you don't. Got me? Yeah, I got you, Leo. Don't fucking drop me. Just hold on to me, okay? I'm in it. Don't drop me. I won't. That was the last time I listened to your fucking ideas. Take it easy. You're still alive, aren't you? I'm just saying. I almost died. No, you didn't. Let's get going. You think Harvey still got the diamond? I do. What makes you so sure about that? I don't know, a gut feeling, I guess. And it's not like it's easy to sell something like the Black Arlong. I still don't get how the hell you pull that off. Well, I'm actually good at what I do. 